This is Matt, and these are the metal vinyl releases for December 2024. Starting with December 6th, expect the debut studio album from Danish death metal band Neckbreaker. This is within the Viscera to be released by Nuclear Blast Records. Vinyl variant will be transparent red-black marbled. Also, music videos are available for Horizon of Spikes, Shackled to a Corpse, and Face Splitting Madness. Of the three, I'm finding Shackled to a Corpse to be the strongest track, but the other two are also well worth hearing. But definitely check them all out at the Nuclear Blast Records YouTube channel. So some thoroughly headbangable death metal with some prog leanings and some hints of asphyx as well. Really dug what I heard of the band. I'll be looking more into this release when it drops. Also on December 6th, look out for a live album from German melodic black death band Thulkandra. This is Live Demise to be released by Napalm Records. Vinyl variant will be white gold marbled. There's also a live performance video available for the track Fallen Angels Dominion. You can find that at the Napalm Records YouTube channel. So the available track certainly rides that Black Death line pretty well with plenty of blasts and rapid riffs. So I'll definitely check this one out when it drops. And also on December 6th will be the debut solo album from American guitarist Michael Wilton. This is Whip Volume 1 to be released by Rat Pack Records. Of course, Michael Wilton is a long-standing member of the band Queensryche, just in case some of you actually didn't know that. Anyways, Vinyl Variant will be red and black colored. There will also be test pressings and autograph copies available exclusively at the Rat Pack Records website while supplies last. So anyways, no music videos or audio clips available. And along with Wilton describing this as hard rock, there really isn't much else to go on. So I guess we'll find out what it's all about on release day. And also on December 6th, we'll get the ninth studio album from Danish black and death metal band Panzerkreist. This is Maleficum 1 to be released by Emancipation Productions. Vital variant will be classic black in an unspecified number of copies. And again, no music videos or audio clips available for this one either. So again, we'll just have to wait for release day to actually hear something. Moving on to December 13th, expect the latest live album from German power metal band Halloween. This is Live at Budokan to be released by Raining Phoenix Music. Vinyl variants will be red, white, marbled, as well as orange. Also, two live performances from this album are available, both Best Time and Eagle Fly Free. You can watch both of those at the Raining Phoenix Music YouTube channel. So, while not a real Halloween fan, the performances are well played and well mixed, enough to make me think that this will be a pretty quick purchase for fans of the band. No doubt. Also on December 13th will be a demo collection from American funeral doom metal band Bellwitch. This is Demo 2011 to be released by The Flenzer. Final variants will be Silver and Black Merge with White Splatter at 100 copies. Silver and Black Merge at 500 copies. Black and Clear Butterfly with Silver Splatter at 100 copies at an artist exclusive. And Black in an unspecified number of copies. There are also some, if not all, of the demo tracks available to hear at the official YouTube channel for The Flenser, which is the name of the label putting this out. Check those out if interested. Anyways, the production on these demos is pretty good, so I wouldn't expect poor quality recordings here at all. I've been meaning to look more into this band, and maybe these demos are a good place to start. We'll see. Moving on to December 20th, look out for the fourth studio album from American black metal band Canis Dearest. This is By the Grace of Death to be released by Bind Rune Recordings. Vinyl variant will be Oxblood Black Color Merge. Also, a visualizer video is out for the track Once Cursed Path Glistens in the Sun. You can find that at the Bind Rune Recordings YouTube channel. So some real variety, ambience, and aggression here, not to mention some decent production. And even though I'm not the biggest black metal fan out there, I might still look into this one because it definitely has me curious. Also on December 20th will be the second studio album from Polish thrash metal band Pandemic. This is Phantoms to be released by Dying Victims Productions. Vinyl variants will be a regular edition on black vinyl with an insert, a poster, a sticker, a postcard, and a download code. As well as a special edition on bone colored vinyl and with the same inclusions plus a woven patch. Visualizer videos are available for both the title track as well as for Santa Muerte, and while both are good, the title track is just a little bit stronger. But of course, you should check out both of them at the Dying Victims Productions YouTube channel. So it's definitely thrash, but with some strong speed and trad leanings as well. 
Definitely heard enough to want to hear more. Not bad at all. As for reissues on vinyl, available now is a repress of the second solo album from Tony Iommi, featuring vocalist Glenn Hughes called Fused from No Remorse Records. Also a reissue for the debut EP from 200 Stab Wounds called Piles of Festering Decomposition, released by Metal Blade Records. Also available now is a repress of the eighth studio album from Machine Head called Bloodstone and Diamonds, released by Nuclear Blast Records. On December 6th, we'll get a reissue of The Art of Dying by Death Angel, also through Nuclear Blast Records. And also on December 6th, we'll be a repressing of Fulci's opening the Hellgates album via Code 7 UK. So the usual December with the usual lack of releases, which is why this video is so short. But if you saw something here that you want to get, let me know. Also, let me know if you know of a release that was worth mentioning, but I just didn't get to cover it. Admittedly, I don't catch everything, so definitely drop those releases and anything else relevant in the comments below. And if you got something out of this video and it prompts you to check out more of my videos, definitely consider subscribing to the channel. I would really appreciate that, of course. Also, maybe give this video a like and also feel free to share a video or two of mine with your friends on social media. That's how we get the word out. Anyways, if you're new to the channel, just so you know, my name is Matt. This is the Accusation Network, where each and every week I do videos on metal vinyl collecting, but also classic and modern metal in general. Definitely check out my playlist. I do a lot of shows in and around those subjects. So there you go. Anyways, as always, thank you for watching, and come back next month for even more metal vinyl releases.